Hey, hey. Welcome. This is the Sand Tuck Man on the pod, being Fisherman's View on Life. <clears throat> Excuse me. Just checking in. I ain't been here in a minute, but I just want to see everybody. Everybody is still here, kicking it around for a minute. Hope everybody has been doing good. So just on here to let you know that I have uh, been hitting up on my uh, 20th year me account. And I'm here to tell you my, my family is growing and growing. I've had uh, at least another 10 relatives call me or text me, rather, to say, hey, you're my cousin. Now go to me, my cousin too. <laughs> and we've never met. Like my cousin, uh, Miss Clark, she's up in Virginia. And uh, we were supposed to hook up a couple weeks ago. I was up there visiting, but uh, things went awry, so we couldn't get together. However, we're slated to get together uh, my next trip up, which is going to be sometime in the spring. Right? So we get together, say hey to one another, and have everybody trip out because nobody, nobody has ever met one another. We ain't in contact. And now, technology has brought us together. So we are just going to try and do this thing best we can. So far, I've contacted about 500 of the uh, 5,000 <laughs> family members that I have. And so, as long as I'm keeping moving and trying to get everybody, this is not a job. This is a interest. And so, I don't hear all seven. I got this Bethany Hood. I've been trying to get get stuff sent, but it won't go. I don't know what the deal is with it. Can't connect with her. Princeton, Texas. Bethany Hood, trying to say hey, and it ain't coming through. There's something wrong. But anyway, I'm just going to call out a few names. Hello, David. Hello, Maddie out there in Virginia. Who brought to you there, David? Best wishes. But uh, things are okay down there. Yeah, I mean, sent hellos out to about 500 people. And only about a dozen have said hello. That's my third cousin, fourth cousin, fifth cousin. I got a fourth cousin here on my, see what side of On my mom's side. Then he's uh, saying hello. So all of my people out there, if you uh, want to say hey, feel free to give me a call. I would love for you to come in on my chat line. Let's see if I can call. Come in and chat so we can talk about this crazy family and everybody all over the place. I got my cousin, uh, who is this? Charlie Bryant, Tassie, Florida. Hello, Charlie. Anybody in Florida know him? Tell him his cousin looking for him. This is the Sam Chuck man. Fisherman's view of life. Life is pretty sad. How many, uh, 
tradesmen we got out here. So I had a friend that just told me some, oh, I got Marvie Sanders right here in South Carolina. I had a friend that just told me some stuff. He said, uh, you know, as a trade person, you make up so much. But for the most part, you're not making great money. You need that great money. As a hairstylist, you want to be bringing in four, five thousand a week. As a barber, you're going to be bringing in roughly three thousand a week. That's great, right? But for the average tradesman, thirty to forty is the is the good money. Okay, as hairstylists, cosmetol I mean uh, barbers, esthetician, nail techs, all the people there bringing about thirty five, forty thousand. It ain't great money. It's good money. Keep the lights on. So my friend has decided to leave the trades and go get a nine to five. That's making 80,000. And you don't have to put up with the hope people come in for an appointment. Or can I get a discount? You know what I mean? So he's just getting ready to go to the uh, railroad. And make that good money. Got a full one k. Got a uh, IRA. Uh, pay that off. All that good stuff that goes along with having a job. Now. And he was like, "Yeah." And I was like, "Hey, I understand, man." Because you're dealing with a whole lot of people. So, got to do what you got to do. It's good money is needed, great money is needed, you know. Everybody gotta make money. If you ain't making money, you're gonna make time. That's all it is to it. I don't wanna do no time. <laughs> I'm not going to jail, man. Where is some of my people that out there that listen to me, that's following me? Follow me, follow me. Let me see if my cousin Nick, yeah. I'm going to call my cousin Nick. See what we got. This is Nick. Hi. How you doing? Hey, I was looking at these um, shoes because I was going to. So, what these are? Yep. This is my cousin, Nikki. <laughs> Hi, I've been guest on the show before. Yep. You know, just shopping around for the crates. <laughs> yeah, come on, I'm going to be on here for about another 20 minutes and I'm going to pick up my buddy and go do some work at the house. Well, let me get a smoke a cigarette while I'm on it so that I can like get up, get up the store and so hold my buddy. <laughs> you, you can finish your chocolate and call me back. No, I'm going to be on the podcast. Okay, okay. It's so cool having a cousin who has a podcast. Yeah. Well, thank you, thank you. Can this I is song for everybody. Uh, can you do it? Ma'am, ma'am, I'm on a podcast right now. Can I go put my buggy right here? Right, <laughs> tell us, tell us the pod being fishing is viewing life. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, when I get on the phone, I tell everybody about you. Well, thank you, thank you. Let me know where you go, and uh, I'll be live, and you can have them all around me asking questions. <laughs> I'm actually gonna go next week. Oh, okay. Okay. So um I'm gonna go for seven days. I'm going to the on um, the Norwegian Crema. Mm -hmm. We're gonna call the mail. We're gonna go like on a submarine. Okay. I don't 
I don't want to be on the submarine. Well, it just goes 150 feet under the water. Mm. That's, so, that's 149 but, feet too deep for me. We're going to fly out there with like one bag in my medical bag uh -huh. so that I can be like a homeless person mm -hmm. and I can like see what it's like just traveling with one carry on. Okay. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I'm a little weird, guys. Yeah. Well, I hear you. Well, enjoy yourself. I'm sorry I'm not going to be there to be with family on that cruise. Well, after, though, this summer is when we're going to meet up and um, we're going to talk. We can talk about, like, Alien and UFO. Like, did you hear Lester Holtz on the NBC News? Uh -huh. uh, we can talk about Project Blue Beam and um, a bunch of fun stuff if you want to. Yes, yes. I'm going to be doing the video. I'm gonna try. I got this uh, this uh, stuff going on with the uh, lending right now. I gotta get stuff taken care of, so I can't hit my credit. Once I get my credit thing hooked up, I can get the video, and we can pull up in the parking lot and just video chat. Oh my God! Now we should go downtown. Yeah, we could go anywhere, anywhere. It'd be so fun outside. Mm -hmm. That would be so fun. We can like go outside, and I can just really cute. Yep. <laughs> we can invite total strangers to come up and talk about they yes, yes. And, and i'll ask them if they believe in ufos yeah like, listen did you believe in because i believe that these things on my on my page are like are spiritual mm -hmm. okay i don't think that it's aliens or ufos okay there's spiritual things in the sky but we're going to talk about that downtown dream that'll be so fun we can get some ice cream and some lunch yeah we can do anything, man. This is this is just amazing. I I really want to meet as many of my family members as I can that are in the area. I guess I'm in Greenville, of course. You, I got uh, Greer, uh, Columbia, Newberry, and uh, uh, somewhere in North Carolina around here. But I want to get out. Huh? So, do you have somebody named John Hunter Johnson on there? I don't even know. No. Cause that's my brother. Oh yeah. Yeah, and you're on my dad's side, so that's like my that's my half brother on my um dad's side, and I think you're on my dad's side. Yeah, I think you're on my mom's side. So coming up on mine, so your dad is related to my mom somehow. Yeah, that's so cool, isn't it? Yeah, this is amazing, man. We need to get together, have some pictures. I bring my albums of what I got, and uh, take all of the people because somewhere along the line there's some old people. Old pictures of people getting together, and even then we could say, "That's it, right there." These are the reasons. <laughs> These are the cool people in the family. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, man. Oh, nice. I guess I'm gonna go back into Ross and uh, continue shopping. Okay. But I will be Nikki Nelson on the show. Okay. After, I have to get cataract surgery in April. Okay. So probably May would be a good time. Okay. We get there. Okay. Right. Well, um, thanks for calling me. You're more than welcome, cuz. Thank you for answering. You be good, okay? You're welcome. You too. Bye bye. bye. That was my cousin. That's how it goes, man. I call them and they they answer. And we get to talking on the phone about what we're going to do. But the sad part about it is she's in Greenville, South Carolina, and I'm right here in, in uh, Carlisle, South Carolina. We're about an hour away. From one another and never knew he, she existed. Never knew it. Absolutely sad. Let me call my cousin Jennifer, see what she got going on. She's moving to Florida. Where you going, Jennifer? Let's see if she answered the phone first. Hello? Can I get a what? what? She ain't asking. Okay, she might be gone. I hate that one. But anyway, we have uh, a lot of a lot of family that is right around us and don't even know it, man. So we gotta get ourselves together and find the family members so we can take advantage of all kinds of situations. Some family members out there now are probably struggling trying to find good help. 
and you got your nephew cousin over there that you you didn't know existed, ain't got a job. Be the help, good help you're looking for. You see that? You see, you see that coming around? You save yourself, man. It's a shame. I didn't know you existed all this time. So, let me see. Robert might be at work. I don't know. I'll call this in. Another cousin. She might be at work, so. Yeah, I ain't gonna know. Hello, today. <clears throat> All right. Well, I try to contact as many of my cousins as I possibly can so that I can have a good hookup of family and friends. Who family rhythm. Like I just found the R spinner. He's not related to the spinners. <laughs> All right. He's on my mom's side. How you doing, Mr. R Spinner? I'm assuming R is for Robert. I ain't gonna guarantee it, but it's a it could be a Roberta. <laughs> Hello today, cousin. Send him something. Say hey to him, but uh, he is uh, don't know where he's at. This is what I hate. All of this, this should be you should put a picture on it and you should put your location on it because I, I would love to see what you look like and where you're at. D Shelton, how you doing, D Shelton? You all right today? I hope. He was active six months ago, Caucasian guy. He is my fourth cousin. <laughs> Whomever our fourth great grandparents were, uh, uh, third great great parents, I'm sorry, third and fourth great grandparents, they had a lot of kids. Because that's the majority of my family on 23 of me. Fourth cousin, fifth cousin, third. Third cousin. Well, this is the third, fourth, and fifth cousins. It didn't have to be the majority of Caucasian. He's on my mom's side here. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna send him a hello. Hello today, cousin. He's a young man. He looks to be, he ain't got his, uh, he ain't got his birth date on there. What's a young looking fella? Good looks, running our family. <laughs> Caucasian dude. And I got a Deborah Kelly, 100% Caucasian. Hello, Deborah Kelly, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. She is my fourth cousin. We share the same chromosome number two. She is 100% Caucasian. I'm gonna say my mom's side. Let's see what side she on. Let me get my saxophone out of this. My shit and start playing it. Yep, mom's side. Mom's side over here. 
Mm -hmm. Brother, 20 minutes, nobody has said, nobody has clicked in and said, hello. What's wrong with my people out here? Hello, 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 hello. This is the Santuck man. Santuck man said hello to you. Hello, hello out there. Units, where you at? You at work. That's where you at. Mm. So I'm going to send her a hello. She's on my mom's side. I'm going to send her a hello. She's going to ask that same question. I don't know how we got related. It's a light weight in mine. <laughs> That's how we got related. Somebody played in the I got a Deborah Spikes. Deborah Spikes is, I don't know where she's at, but she's my cousin. She's my fourth cousin. I wonder if she knows the last person. Let's see what side it on. Tell me a story. I think Lisa is on my dad's side. Let me check, make sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, dad's side. Yep, Deborah, you are on my father's side. Deborah Spikes. Hello, Deborah. We are cousins on my father's side. Hope you're doing well today. Sooner, hello. She is, uh, let me see. Don't mm say. -hmm. Desiree, Desiree Williams. Desiree Williams. Hey. Well, that's a name. Pretty name. How you doing, cousin Desiree? Don't know where you're at. Did you my father, uh, my fourth cousin? I don't know what side you're on yet. I'm going to check right now. <laughs> Let it go. Be your <laughs> Looks like mom side. Yeah. Let's do oh, this is the Hello today, cousin. Hope you give me a hit back. Been getting a lot of hello backs. So, thank you. Drusilla. Drusilla Adams, San Jose, California. She was born in 1981, and I joined the Navy in 1981. She's half and half, mulatto. I'm going to go with dad's side of the family. Skip out at you. 
Looks like the mom's side. Kirk Bale is her first cousin. Let me see who Kirk Bale is. Kittrick Bale. My fourth cousin, her first cousin. Drusilla. No, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Erica Miller. Erica Miller, how are you doing? This is your cousin. Say hello to you, Erica. Caucasian. Aaron Fullerton. Aaron Fullerton. Where are you? San Diego, California. I was out there in San Diego. Out there in San Diego. Longest period of time. Two years. Two, three years. Worst two, two years of my life. Hated it, hated it. Uh, take it to the top. Make it one of me. I guess this going up, Roscoe Holly. Then the hug here for it. I'm saying, I'm sad. Say hello. Say hello today, cousin. Yeah, I gotta go get the buddy. Yeah, play him later. 
And then we go from there. But I've been on here 30 minutes, man. Nobody said hello to me. That's all right. That's all right. The next time we get it, we get the next time. So I got a break camp. So thank you all for whoever you are listening. And uh appreciate you. So you be good. Give me a give me a uh, hello the next time you decide to come in, okay? All right, here's the countdown. <laughs> Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Boom.